Hello everyone. Um, Loom, as you know, I love Loom, has come out with a new um, update and it now allows you to edit your Loom videos and you can either add clips to the beginning or to the end or in the middle of your clips and it doesn't have to be a Loom video. It could actually be a video that was recorded outside of Loom. So I wanted to do an example um, with a video that I just recently recorded and I screwed up the very beginning. I actually um, mentioned the person's name in error. Um, I used the wrong name. So I'm going to remove Good that Good morning, portion. Karen. I wanted to come in and um, give you a free YouTube channel audit. So that's what I screwed up. So I wanna uh, remove, it's probably about uh, 10 seconds. I wanna remove the first 10 seconds. So I'm gonna go to trim and clip. And this is where you're going to see um, your timeline and the waveform. And then you see here, it allows you to add another clip. This is how you're going to be able to stitch your videos together now in Loom. So what I did was I actually re-recorded the intro. And so I've already done that in Loom. So I'm going to come here. And as you can see, you can paste a Loom URL or you can search for um, a video. And remember that the way that you upload videos to Loom, it wouldn't be from here outside of Loom, is that you would have to actually just go to, let me show you really quickly. Um, let me open up another window so that you can see what this is. So here you would go to new um, video and then you would upload. And so that's how you would get a video that's from outside of Loom. So we're going to go here. This is the intro redo. Um, it's actually 22 seconds. So it's longer. It probably, I could probably trim it a little bit. And so now you come down here. And so now this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to click on this and I'm going to say that I want this to go to the right. So that way this comes to the head. And then remember the first 10 seconds of this was what I wanted to remove. Um, so I'm going to say probably about there. And then I am going to save. So now I'm going to play it. Hi, Gail. I wanted to come in and give you a free uh, YouTube channel audit. I know that we had spoken um, already and I knew that you had a YouTube channel. So I just thought I would provide this to you. So I came on to and channel. So that's cool. It's, it's a quick cut. I'm good with that. It does not bother me, but that is pretty damn neat that you can do that now. So again, you would just go to trim and now it says add clips before it just used to say trim. And so you were able to just edit, um, from the timeline here, but now it's a little bit easier. And if I wanted, I could, unfortunately you can't, um, do anything with regards to um, moving the timelines together, but it like I, you know, like we saw, it was pretty. Hi, Gail. I wanted to come in and give you a free uh, YouTube channel audit. That's fine. Obviously, if I wanted it to be perfect, I would just make sure that my positioning um, was similar to the way that I did it before, but this actually works. And so I'm good to go on this one. All right. So I just wanted to come in really quickly and share with you guys that Loom, as you know, I've always been talking about it, is constantly improving and updating their tool. This actually makes things a whole lot better. It was one of their number one top requested features that we've been asking for, and they finally have provided it to us. So enjoy. Take care. Bye.